Hi, I'm Mark Camosio and we're at Pete's Air Gun Farm and I'm here to show you, um, it's actually a brand new model from Hatsan, this is the Proxima and um, <clears throat> what makes this unusual, it's a gas ram power plant in it, um, under lever action but it's also got a um, multi-shot magazine system which obviously is very unusual, I mean I think, thinking back Theoban did it with their, um, was it the Imperator? Um, but this having a magazine system in a spring or gas ram is very unusual so it's um, quite a quite an exciting model and um, there's a lot of features in it too so you're getting uh, as I say the gas ram power plant and you've got this quite attractive walnut stock um, which has got the adjustable cheek piece as you can see there just slacken those big bolts uh, it comes with sling swivels as standard you've got a sling swivel mounted there um, it's got a manual and automatic safety catch. You've got the Quattro trigger, which is um, I'm well, often been quite impressed with on these hat sands. Can adjust down to, to quite a light setting, which is good. Nice setback blade as well, quite comfortable. Um, you've got a rubber back pad there. Um, <clears throat> looking to the front, you've got this. Obviously, this is the um, retaining catch there. That's I have to say, it's a bit fiddly on the fingers. It's a bit like Virox early. Fire 77s um, when they were playing around with different catches but I would prefer a ball detent on there uh, but you have to push that forward um, but obviously they've got sling swivels on here already so you could because normally they would want a, um, a secure fitting like it's got because you're going to fit possibly a sling swivel there but you're not going to do that so um, maybe a ball detent would have been better but it's a, it's a nice nice handling rifle. Um, so you've got the pistol grip there with your finger contours, quite a deep forend. Um, on the scoping mounting front you've got uh, Picatinny style. Um, you've got a rail there which is all part of the um, cylinder. And then Picatinny style slots also going in. I've just used a one piece mount on here which is probably advisable with gas rams um, or a lot of recoiling um, air guns in general. Um, and obviously that's gone straight onto the dovetails, but underneath there you can see one there, but there's a series of slots so you can use Picatinny mounts as well. Um, <clears throat> now actually with the, the cocking cycle on this, so you've got, I'll show you the magazine afterwards, but I've got three or four pellets still in the chamber. So what I'll do is I'll just show you the how the system would normally work. So you'd unclip your lever, cock the rifle all the way back, that engages the safety that automatically index the next shot and then a bit like the TX200 from Air Arms you've got a safety bar there which will disengage the safety um, the internal bear trap system press that, that allows the, the lever to come back and then you're ready to fire I'll just fire a few shots until I've emptied that magazine but you'll see the system in operation so I've got to you operate that safety because that's automatically coming on Oh, that's our last shot so what happens there is it actually the internal part of the magazine actually blocks the chamber so you know you've finished so we're back we've cocked it it's all safe so I can remove the magazine I'll just show you that and that is the is, uh, where are we here that's um, yeah I think this is um, Sorry, what's that? Two, four, six, eight, ten. That's a 12 shot magazine. Um, as I say, it's a Theoban style, so you're um, moving your lid around, so it's all spring loaded inside. You fill that up, and then that just clicks back into the recess, which is showing on here. Um, <clears throat> so it all works in, in use, it all works very well. Um, these are 682 pounds, um, and as I say, that does include the um, magazine system and all those features. So you're getting quite a lot of uh, air gun for your money. So that's the Hatsan Proxima.